Hello everybody. So today I will talk about calculus. The topic today is about application of integration. So now I will show you how to answer. The region limited by the curve y equals to 10s minus s square and the s axis is divided in in into equal parts by a line that goes through 0, 0. What is the equation of the line? So now I will show you how to answer. We know that the red line in here should be about y equal to capital A S. And we see that this line is go upward. That means capital A should be greater than number 0. Now, we have the curve in here. So we need to find the intersection in here. And this intersection in here. So we have Y and Y. So we have capital AS equals to 10S minus S square. So I will put this one go to the left. Now we can do about factorization by S. So we have two solutions. S equals to number 0. S plus A minus 10 equals to number 0. So S equals to 10 minus capital A. Now, so this ball in here, that's about S equals to 10 minus A. And this ball in here is about S equal to number 0. We know that the red line in here, they divide this area of this one and this one into equal parts. So, in this situation, we will have about two interactions. The first one, we start from 0 to 10 minus capital A. So we know that the area of the first one, so I will put about capital A number 1 in here. So that's about, we have, this one is about the upper minus the lower, that's about the line. So the upper, that's about the curve. So we have 10s minus s square. The lower, that's about the red line. And we have as The next one, that is about from 0 to this number in here. So for I number 2, we see that we have two smaller parts. If we divide this one, so from the red line and the curl in here. So from 0 to 10 minus A, that is about the red line. And that is about AS. From 10 minus capital A to this point in here. To find about this point, we put about 10S minus S square equals to number 0. So it, this one you got about S equal to number 0 and S equals to number 10. So the point in here is about S equal to number 10. So from 10 minus A to number 10. And this one, that is about the area of the curve in here. So we put 10S minus S square going here. Now we need to calculate about this one. 
the integration of 10x, we have 5x squared. This one, we have x to the power of 3 over 3. This one, we have x squared over 2. And we put the bound from 0 to 10 minus capital A. The integration of this one, we have a x squared over 2. And I will put the bounds from 0 to 10 minus a. This one, we have 5x squared minus x to the power of 3 over 3. And we put the bounds 10 minus a to number 10. So we put everything in here. For the first one, you got about 10 minus capital A to the power of 2 minus 10 minus A to the power of 3 over 3 minus A. And we have 10 minus A to the power of 2 over 2. This one. We have 10 minus a to the power of 2 over 2. This one, if we calculate, you got about 10 square minus 10 to the power of 3 over 3 minus 5 multiplied by 10 minus a to the power of 2 plus 10 minus a to the power of 3 over 3. So, I will put this one, I will put this one and this one go to the left. So, this one we have negative. So this one we have negative a multiplied by 10 minus a squared in here. Because negative 1 over 2, negative 1 over 2, you got negative number 1. This one go to the left. So 5 plus 5 we have number 10. And this one going here, we have negative 2 over 3. This number we calculate. So we have 500, and 500 over 3. So if we look carefully about this one, 10 minus a to the power of 2, 10 minus a to the power of 2, we can do about factorization. And we got about 10 minus a. So 10 minus a square multiplied by 10 minus a, we have 10 minus a to the power of 3. So this one is about 1, 1 minus 2 over 3, we have 1 over 3. Now we simplify number 3 for the both sides, so we just have only 10 minus a to the power of 3 equals to 500. So we put the cubic root for the both sides. So 
So capital A we put on the right. This number we put on the left. And we have the final answer in here. This one approximate about two boy zero six three. And now we go back in here. We put capital A gold here, and we have the final answer. And we know that A is greater than number 0, so that means it is satisfied. This is the end. Thank you for watching.